getting into med school is a dream. Literally, I never thought that I could do it, but... Visiting the campus. Seeing it firsthand. It's now a weird reality. Hey guys, what's going on? It's been a minute. As you can see, I've really let myself go. The beard is just coming out in full force and the hair is just a ridiculous curly mess. And I'm doing it for a reason because I figured now is the best time to try and embrace my primitive primal identity before I go to med school, before I try to embrace a life of professionalism. And no, I'm just kidding. Honestly, I'm doing it because why not? You know, I figure like, hey, What's this gonna look like after a month and a half of traveling on the road in a van? But it's been fun, it's been a lot of fun. My first destination on my trip thus far has been actually visiting the University of South Carolina School of Medicine in Greenville and seeing and being on the campus where I'm gonna be attending med school for the next four years. And I gotta tell you what, it was pretty cool. <laughs> it was super cool being on the campus, seeing the, the sign up on the wall, seeing how new and lively the facilities were, just being there. It's sort of immersing myself in this, in this, this image of what is going to be in store for me for the next upcoming years. And I gotta tell you what, all the suffering, all the hours you spend studying and practicing for interviews and writing personal statements and work experience sections and, and getting letters of recommendation, all of that sucks. But I'll tell you what, when you finally get accepted to med school and you're finally standing on the campus and you like look around at everything and you're like, holy crap, I'm here. All of that stuff seems like nothing in comparison to the euphoria you experience when finally witnessing firsthand what it is you've accomplished. And for me, it's sort of gotten rid of a lot of those initial anxieties that I talked about in previous videos where it's like, uh, I don't know if I deserve this or, or why me, why me? You know, like the imposter syndrome that you face, all of that kind of like evaporated in a weird way. And it, it coalesced into this one moment of like unifying realization where I was like, wow, this is it. It's pretty cool. Anyway, that's pretty geeky, but it's kind of true. And I wanted to make a little video talking about my experience on campus because first of all, I just wanted to let you know what I'm up to. And second of all, I thought that it was just a really cool thing to talk about because many of you are out there right now applying to medical school or you're waiting for acceptances if you're on the wait list or, or if you're going to med school and uh, you don't know what to anticipate and you have no idea what to expect. So those are some cool thoughts to maybe look forward to. But yeah, it was just really fun being there and it was like so cool. And Greenville is an absolutely beautiful city. I walked around downtown and I gotta be honest with you, I fell in love. It was like one of the most beautiful places, like one of the most inspiring places I've been to in a long time because it's a city but it's just small enough and quiet enough where it's not really a city. Anyways, I plan to come out with a video, a little vlog talking about all the places that I went to in Greenville and sort of, sort of talk about my whole experience doing that. So I'm gonna do that in a separate video. This is more or less just gonna focus on my experience visiting the USC campus firsthand. And it was great, great. It was, there's not much else to say about it. Like I went on a Saturday and I couldn't like go into the facilities or anything like that, but just being there on the campus, it, it just, it felt, it feels real. It feels real now, like, that, it's real. It's right there. I proved it. I made sure that it wasn't a fake school. Um, yeah, that's where I'm going. And so I hope that you enjoyed the little B-roll, all the footage that I took because I enjoyed making it. Um, and I hope you enjoyed my little blurb talking about what it was like because, um, I don't know, a lot of you have been here since the beginning when I first made this channel. and you see me grow and, and go through all of these stages. So I just wanna share that experience with those of you who have been with me thus far and thank those of you who are maybe new here. But yeah, those are my first impressions of the school. It was awesome, it was great. And I just want you to sort of imagine what it's gonna be like when you finally get accepted to school after all the hard work that you are putting yourself through. Just remember, it's not for nothing. You're not doing this for nothing. You're doing it 
because eventually you will get something out of it. You will be somewhere studying medicine, studying to be a doctor, a nurse, a PA, whatever the hell you're studying to be. I don't know, an engineer. You'll get there, you'll get there and it's gonna pay off. And one day you're gonna have that, that amazing feeling that I experienced being on campus, which is just sort of the, the, the overwhelming realization that all of this is real. It's all real and it's gonna happen, and it'll happen for you. And I hope that it does, and I hope that you stay inspired and motivated and, and work through what is no doubt one of the most difficult periods of your life, which is applying to med school. Man, it's tough. So uh, anyways, I, I have a bunch of videos coming out that hopefully will help guide you through the med school admissions process, talk about my experiences, talk about things that I'm afraid of down the road, uh, and just sort of hang out with me and talk everything med school, talk everything about uh, the MCAT and the admissions process. And if that's what you're into and that's what you want, then I definitely recommend that you join the family, hit the subscribe button, and just come hang out and listen to me ramble and talk and grow really disgusting patchy facial hair with crazy, ridiculous, curly uh, Afro stuff because that's what I'm doing here. Anyways. Thank you so much. If you wanna support me, you don't have to do anything other than just like the video. If you really enjoyed this video, or if you enjoy my content at all, just like the video is all you gotta do. And remember, I'm trying to do an upcoming Q&A video just to sort of talk about everything regarding what's going on with my life and you can ask me anything you want and I'll answer it. So if you wanna ask me more questions, leave them in the comments. But thank you guys so much for sticking around. A lot more content on the way, I promise. And uh, just be patient with me because I'm traveling and it's weird living in a van uh, doing all this YouTube stuff. But anyways, uh, thank you again. Thank you again for being here. As always, guys, we will see you in the next video. Peace.